clouds which are formed when water evaporates and condenses in the sky transforming into ice crystal due to extremely cold temperatures in the atmosphere around minus 55 degrees celsius however when witnessing heavy rainfall one may question that why clouds which are loaded with water still floats in the sky what is the weight of the cloud and how much water is present in it so let's discuss first why cloud floats the primary factor which is responsible for floating of cloud is density in simple word the density is the arrangement of particles and how close they are packed each other when particles are closely packed its density increases which increases the overall weight of the object if the particle are packed but there is gap between them its density is less which decreases the overall weight of the object this is considered when an object has a constant volume clouds have more water content but the particle in the clouds are less dense than the air below the cloud so that's why the cloud floats it is same phenomena as a person floats in the dead sea because in that the person density is less than the dead sea density second weight of clouds to determine the weight of cloud let's consider a cumulus cloud with dimension of 1 cubic kilometer which is equal in height and length normally the cloud has a density of 0.5 g per cubic meter so the weight of 1 cubic kilometer cloud will be 5 lakh kg third water content in a single cloud as you know that the 1 kg is equal to 1 liter so if the weight of cloud is 5 lakh kg it will contain 5 lakh liters of water that's amazing in short if weight of cloud increases then water content in it also increases now let's see the factors affecting the weight of clouds and water content in it the water content in clouds is influenced by various factor like types of cloud humidity pressure density and many more there are many types of cloud such as cumulus cloud cirrus cloud cirro cumulus cloud alto cumulus cloud strato cumulus cloud cumulonimbus cloud and many more in which the cumulonimbus cloud is responsible for heavy rain thunderstorm lightning hail storm and fast wind speed the average cumulonimbus cloud has a height of 11 km and has a higher water content so the weight of this cloud will also be more considering the other factor if humidity and density increases the weight of cloud also increases i hope you have now understand that how much water is present in a single cloud and also the weight of that cloud thank you